Hi everyone, this is Coach Ip. Today we are going to talk about the fifth movement in Tao Ying Su, Li Ban Pan Shi. So to begin, put your both feet together, hands by your side. Bend your knees slightly, sinking down, shift your weight to your right, left leg step up into your horse stance. Both palms embrace. Inhale, lifting up, palms at your chest level. Rotate your palms, opening to the side. Exhale, sinking down, lower. Inhale, lift. Avoid lifting your shoulders. Exhale, sink. To return, inhale, lift. Both palms facing down, shift weight to your right, left toe turn in. Exhale, palms down, legs together. Right. A few things to take note in doing this movement okay, for our both st uh, horse stance. Avoid knee pushing out towards your toe or collapsing inwards. Keep your body upright from the side view. As we embrace, avoid leaning forward okay, in order to open wide. So based on how much your body can stay upright, that's how far our horse tank will be lifting. If let's say your width of your horse tank is much narrower, then your distance that you go down will also be affected. So don't force through any point you feel pressure to your knees. Okay, then you need to take note and readjust your movements. So for breathing wise, inhale, lift. Exhale down. Keep your movement or keep your breathing as natural as possible without holding too much tension okay, and relax during the pose. Alright, so this is the fifth movement of Tao Ying Su, Li Ban Pan Shi. Thank you everyone, and I'll see you for the next tutorial.